Today's topic, non-Newtonian fluids. Good old Sir Isaac Newton came up with some laws based off of how solids, liquids, and gases should behave. This guy right here is the rebel. He does not follow the rules of good old Sir Isaac Newton, hence the name non-Newtonian fluid. Let's take a look. So if you take a look at my fluid here, my substance, it looks as though it's a liquid. However, its viscosity is gonna change depending on the amount of pressure that I apply. So if I just kind of put my hand in here, it looks like a liquid. Let's see if I can put enough pressure down on my mouth to actually keep me up. So let's see if I can. <laughs> Next up, I want to see if my cornstarch and water make sure my nine will protect my egg. I want to see if my fluid will absorb enough energy and not transfer that energy over to the egg to actually crack the shell. So let's just do a quick little drop test. I'll put a little tail on here just to kind of keep it balanced during flight so hopefully it stays up right on the Egg, perfectly fine. What do you say we up the ante a little bit? This is what I call up in the ante. Let's see how it works. One, two, three. We have a whole egg. All right, let's try that one more time. This time I'm gonna throw it up even higher. We still have a whole egg.